Welcome. Our first competitor, Nicholas Chesmore, is looking set to win his second consecutive World Cup with 16 wins under his belt this year. Today, he looks relaxed and confident it will be an easy win. Our next competitor, Nathan Gerber, fought hard to make it here today, surprising us all. He is definitely the underdog going into this matchup, looking for his first World Cup win. Today, with so much on the line, he looks nervous yet excited to participate. Welcome to the 2020 Sail Jousting World Cup here in Maidenbar Bay, where the first joust is about to start. The weather over here is pretty cloudy with not a whole lot of wind. And here's the whistle. Sailors line up. And a throw. And ooh, both of them get glancing blows off the side, which will count for one point for each of them. Tie them up going into the second round. As Chesmar and Gerber line up for their second joust, type 1-1, to one, their goals will be to try and land another body blow and avoid their opponents so that they can get a lead going into the third round. Here they are. Whistle. They're lining up to prepare and throw. Ooh, a wild throw by Gerber, and Chesmore doesn't even have to avoid. After that one, I can bet you Gerber is feeling a lot of emotions about missing that shot. It's going to make it a lot harder for him to catch up and win now. He'll have to win both of these next jousts in order to secure victory. Here they are, going to the third joust with Chesmore up 2-1 to one against Gerber. They're lining up. Here's the whistle. Oh no, it looks like Chesmore was playing dirty. Threw one right at Gerber's head. I hope he's okay. Now, according to the rules, as a penalty, this round's result will be voided, and they will joust another round, but Chesmore will be unable to use a lance. This gives Gerber a huge opportunity to score a point on Chesmore and tie it up going into the final round. As we approach the fourth joust, we can see Chesmore dutifully handing over his pull note to the officials. For Gerber, this shot is everything. In order to get a shot of victory, Gerber must successfully win this bout. Gerber does it. He hits Chesmore straight in the chest. This means we will go on to a fifth bout where either of them can win. They approach. With all the marbles on the line. They throw. And oh! Gerber has knocked Chesmore out of his boat with such a solid blow. Let's see that over again. Wow. So much power. What an amazing end to a great day of jousting with Nathan Gerber coming out on top to clutch a victory as the 2020 Sail Jousting World Champion. He's so excited he even took a dip in the lake to celebrate. Well that's all folks for the 2020 Sail Jousting World Cup. See you next year.